Daniel Cormier is looking to get his trilogy fight with Stipe Miocic out of the way so he can retire and move on with his life, which prompted him to recently tell Stipe to sign the contract. Stipe says, I want to fight DC. It's going to happen, period. I'm going to give my fans what they want to see. My management has been working on dates with the UFC. Right now, I'm doing what Governor DeWine is advising, and I'm working as a first responder. I can't control a global pandemic. My head coach can't open his gym by law right now. I don't hold myself higher than any person in regards to what I'm allowed to do. Ohio is under orders until May 29th. The second the gym can open, we begin camp. Plain and simple. I have never ducked anyone. I've never turned down a fight and I never will. Strap number six coming soon. Another heavyweight who's hoping Stipe and DC fight sooner than later is Francis Ngannou. He'd like to get a title shot versus the winner. But before he worries about the result of that fight, he needs to take care of business Saturday night at USC 249 when he takes on Jair Zinho Rosenstroik. If Rosenstroik wins, he will probably be next in line for the belts. A win over Ngannou means he beat the highest ranked guy besides DC, and he'll be a perfect 11-0 in his career. So there's a lot on the line for that fight, which will be the third last fight on a ridiculous stacked USC 249 card Saturday from Jacksonville, Florida. And the USC appear to be taking the health and safety of everyone at this event very seriously. They're testing everyone at the show, from the fighters to the cornermen to the media and all attending parties, which are very limited to begin with. The next pay-per-view after this will be USC 250 on June 6. Nunes and Spence are expected to be on it. One other recently added bout was Juicier Formiga versus Alex Perez. Anderson Silva just got knee surgery and says he'll be 100% now. He injured his leg in his bout with Jared Cannonier in May of last year. Cannonier himself was sidelined due to torn pectoral muscle and is expected to be out until the summer.